Hey everyone, it's Mr. Kyle, back again. Um, this time today, what we're gonna do is a little bit of an upper body workout. So all you need really is a chair or a couch um, or something about this height, it's about knee high, um, and some open space and we'll get ready to rock and roll. But first, what I want you to do is check out my warm up video and do that warm up workout. And then when you're done with that, Come back to this one, um, go to this spot, and we'll get ready to rock and roll um, with our upper body workout. So, see you in about five minutes. Welcome back. Let's get to it. What we got to do for our upper body workout is we have, we're gonna do two circuits, but first, um, I'm gonna go over the first circuit with you. Uh, it has five exercises in it, and we're gonna do, um, those exercises without any rest in between them. And then after we're done with the fifth exercise, we'll do a little bit of rest before we do that whole circuit again. But first, what we're gonna, what I'm gonna go over with you are the exercises that we want to do. So the first exercise that we're gonna do in the circuit um, are called plank shoulder taps. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna go, you're gonna be in push up position, all right, like so. If you can't hold this position, you can just drop down to your knees. All right, so you're gonna be in push-up position and all you're gonna do is without wiggling too much, is you're gonna lift up one arm, touch your shoulder, then the other one touches the other shoulder. And one rep is when you touch each shoulder one time. So I'll do one, one, two, two. All right, so that's the first one. Those are plank shoulder First taps. exercise, the second one we're gonna do is what I call Superman's. Okay, you're gonna lay down on the, on the ground your arms are gonna be out in front of you. Make sure you have enough space for your feet and your hands laying on your belly. What Supermans are is you're gonna lift up your feet or your legs and your arms like you're flying through the sky, right? Like Superman. Hold it for a one Mississippi and back down. So you're gonna come up, hold one Mississippi, back down, that's one rep. If it's too difficult for you to lift up both your feet and your hands, that's all right. Modification for this, another way to do this is just to lift up your upper body or just your lower half, your choice. All right, so Superman's again, lifting up feet and arms, back down. All right, cool, so we have plank shoulder taps, we have Superman's. Next thing we're gonna do are called plyo push-ups. So unlike regular push-ups, we're gonna start in the modified push-up position, so you're on your knees, okay? And make sure when you're doing modified push-ups, you're not just bringing your, bringing your uh, head and chest down to the ground. You wanna make sure your whole body moves down with you. So you can cross your feet like I have, or you can leave them uh, non-crossed. For me, it's more comfortable to do this. Pile push-ups though, I'll face you guys so you can see. What you wanna do is you wanna start out a little wider, come down, do a push-up, and then bring your hands in nice and tight and do a push up. That's one rep. You wanna make it more challenging, you push up, you do a little jump in the push up, and you just go back and forth. Again, if you don't feel like jumping, push up, walk your hands in, push up, and out. So one rep for the plyo push ups is down, and then in, and then back out, that is one. Okay, fourth exercise in this circuit, I like to call plank surrenders. What you're gonna do is you're gonna start in a normal push-up position, then you're gonna drop down into an elbow plank, and then push yourself back up into normal plank. That's one. So you go down, push yourself up, that would be two. Feel free if you want, alternate the hand that goes up first or down first, that's fine. Um, Alternate or a modified version for this if it's too difficult. Again, you're on your knees in like a modified push up position. You're in, your, in the position on your hands, drop down to the elbow, push back up like so. Okay, so plank surrenders. So the fifth one is going to be a little bit more cardio for you because you know, we got to work our hearts as much as we do our upper body muscles. So what you're going to do is you're going to do jumping jacks. Again, it's part of the warm up, just a simple jumping jack like that or if you don't like to jump, step and jack it out. 
All right, so those are our five exercises. I'll go through one round with you, and then I'm gonna leave it up to you to do the next two. Circuit's done here, we're gonna start with the shoulder taps, okay? So with me, in your high plank position, or the modified version, we're gonna do 10 taps each arm, so 10 reps, all right? So try and stay with me. We're gonna start with the right hand, and go. One, one, two, two, three, three, four, four, five, five, six, six, seven, seven, eight, eight, nine, nine, ten, ten. And down on your knees to rest. Okay, cool. All right, Superman, ready? We're on our bellies, hands out, feet out. We're gonna lift up in three, two, one, up, and down, one, up, down, that's two, up, down, that's three, up, four, up, five, up, down six, up, down seven, up, eight, up, nine, up, and ten. Good job. Now to plyo push-ups. Modified push-up stance. Hands start wide out. And down, out, in, out, in. Good, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more. 10. Good. Nice job. All right, cool. All right, plank surrenders. Now that our plow job, plow push ups are done, we're going on to plank surrenders. So we're starting up, push up position, down to the elbows, and go. And one, two, up, three, down, up, four, up, five. Again, if you need to modify, drop down to your knees and down. Six, down, seven, down, eight, down, nine, one more down, and up, ten. Good, now we're going to jumping jacks. Ready, and twenty of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 17, 18, 19, 20. Good job. Think about, we're going to rest for about one more minute. Then we're going to do those five exercises again. Rest for a minute. Five exercises one more time for a third time total. And then you're good with that circuit. All right, rest for your minute. Then we'll get back to it. That circuit, done. We're done with circuit number one. On to circuit number two, all right? This one only has four exercises in it, so not as much, but the first one are called inchworms. So what you're gonna do is start standing up. You're gonna dial down, touch your toes, and then walk, keep your legs straight, walk out into a push-up position, do a push-up, and then walk it back up, your hands to your feet, stand back up, all right? So you're touching your toes, Walking out, keeping your back straight. If you can't do a regular push-up, go down to the modified version of push-ups, and then, so drop down your knees, but then before you walk back up, make sure you go back on your toes, stand up. So inchworms. All right, exercise two for this circuit are incline push-ups. So it works a little bit different part of your chest than the regular push-up does. You can use a couch. I'm gonna use my little ottoman here, um, but you're just gonna put your feet or your hands up on it, Push up position, and you're just gonna do regular push ups. All right. Those are inclined push ups. All right, third exercise. Back onto your chair, your couch, ottoman, whatever. We're gonna do tricep dips. So you're gonna be here. You can start with your feet flat on the ground if you want. And you're just gonna come down. So your elbows are at 90 degrees. 
back up. All right, so just dipping down, back up. To make it harder, you can go out onto your heels. The farther your feet are apart or from your body, um, the harder it'll be. So you have this version here or out like so. All right, tricep dips. All right, the last exercise for this circuit is personally my favorite. I love doing burpees, all right? So to do burpees, you need a little bit of room. All right, so you're gonna start, just jump up. You're gonna come down, kick back out into a plank position, and then kick your feet back up to your hands, and then jump back up. So a burpee, you go down, kick back, forward, up, okay? So I'll do a couple more. Like so, so you can see you do it. Two burpees right there. All right, modified version. All right, if you don't want to go all the way down to the floor, that's fine. Use your couch, your chair, ottoman, coffee table. Maybe not a good idea to use that. A little bit of hard surface. Um, so what you're gonna do, start up. You're gonna put your hands down like that, kick out, back up, okay? All right, it's a little bit easier than going all the way down to the floor. So if you're not ready for the floor burpee, use your first, the first exercise, circuit number two. All right, ready? Inchworms. All right, we got 10 of them, 10 reps, okay? And begin, touch it down, walk it out, push up, walk it back up, stand up, one. Two, again, when you go down, try and make sure your legs stay as straight as possible. Gives them a little bit of a stretch. Three. Four. Down. Push up. Walk it back. Up. Five. Six. Again. Getting a little bit tired in the upper body, you can always drop down to a modified push up to do your inch corner where you walk it back up. Seven. Eight. Nine. One more, you can do it. And ten. Good. Next exercise, remember, are the incline push-ups. We got 10 of them. Find your incline, get on your couch, your chair, your coffee table, ottoman, whatever it may be. Got 10 of them, ready, and go. We're down, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, one more, 10, good. Now just flip it over, put your hands back on it. You got tricep dips. We're gonna do 15, one, five, 15. Ready, and down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, three more, 13, 14, last one. 15. Good job. All right, now our burpees. We got 10 of them, all right? Again, if you need to use your ottoman or your couch, go ahead. I'm gonna go down to the floor for the first couple and then up to the ottoman, all right? So we're gonna jump. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Circuit's done with. Rest for your minute, then we're gonna do that again. And rest for another minute, then we're gonna do it one last time. All right? Burpees, those are brutal. 
Nice job the upper body workout is done. Uh, now just need to stretch it out, cool down, um, and uh, you know, get our muscles nice and good. Please check out one of Coach Gene's stretching videos to see how to properly cool down. Man.